having ADHD as a Nigerian child. Here is my experience. Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder. We see this definition all the time and usually it is for white little boys running around. But I'm not white and I'm not a little boy. I'm a Nigerian boy. Number one, ITK or commonly known as I too know. As a kid, I would not shut up and there is nothing Nigerian society hates more than a kid that will not shut up about everything that they know. So they call you ITK or I too know, which roughly translates to you are doing too much. It's funny because who is going to tell them that I'm doing too much as a profession now on the internet? Number two, you are too emotional. Oh, this one. I got this one a lot. Why? Because I was emotional and growing up, that was considered weak. Because you're a man. You're supposed to be strong. You're not supposed to cry. You're supposed to take everything like a man. But back then and even now, I've always felt things differently and it does not take a lot for me to cry actually. And to top it off, my favorite insult was that, oh, it's because you were raised by your mom. Which number one, while it is very untrue, is also... And it's sad that the society I grew up in considered anything that is not anger as emotional so we just learn to suppress our feelings and we just keep it all inside which is not healthy for most of us i was emotional because i was overwhelmed most of the times and i did not know that i needed support that i was never going to get number three i was so bored primary school was nice i had good grades there but secondary school oh i was bored out of my mind and back then i would rather go to the game center watch series hey legend of the seeker or do just about anything instead of going to school there was no challenge and in my opinion we were just like hamsters running in a circular wheel with no points to it all best friends this is me and my adhd and i'm sharing this so that there can be more voices out there about how adhd is different especially for people that come from my background if you've been diagnosed or you suspect you have adhd please best friend let me know in the comment section down there below and as always i'm your captain of awesome and i'm from nigeria with love